MG told me he loves me. Did you say it back? I didn't say anything. I just froze. I think I'm broken. He's always had my back. Even when I didn't choose him or deserve it. Just to be clear, that was for you and not me. Just in case I lose. The least I could do was return the favor. But I think you're amazing. What is wrong with me? I don't even know if Ethan is epic romance material. Which is why I have compiled a helpful checklist. Be that. He passed the test. He's totally epic romance material. So why don't I feel anything? Are you serious? You fancy me very much indeed. I fancy sex with you. The jury is out on the rest. I'm trying not to have sex with Sebastian again. Well, I don't need to hear any of so this. We've been having a lot of sex, and, and my mind is telling me to stop, but apparently my body didn't get the message. It's weird. It's like I don't even want to ask myself the question. Maybe you're afraid of getting an answer. Once you have one, nothing's going to be the same. Oh, exactly. Do you think I'm broken? Lizzie felt bad about what happened, so she found a Wiccan wellness retreat to help her manage her control issues, among other things. We don't worry about dicks here. No boys allowed. You count on my steel. Ew. Gross. Knock it off, Lizzie. I'm serious. I didn't do that. I swear. She looks fantastic. She should feel amazing. You smell like honey bears. Granted, her legs are amazing, but she is a royal bitch. What are you doing? I totally get it. She's hot. You guys have something that I never really had. I'm pretty sure that I want. Love. The kind that is soft and built on mutual respect that grows over time. Become something that I would do anything for.